We're headed to the base right now. Um, Blake needs to get some shoes for his blues, so we're gonna pick up some new shoes for him. Blue and shoes. blue shoes. Shiny shoes right there. We're trying to figure out what size Oil he is. Resistant. Not sure. Oh good, so I can wear them on a flight line. Oh great. Which would never happen ever. <laughs> That looks so funny. You look so funny right yeah. now. I dropped the camera in the post office and had a mild heart attack, but we're all good, aren't we? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Camera's very durable, which is one of the reasons why I got it, because... Weeks of what? I said, that's a couple weeks of work and you replace that camera. <laughs> I know, I know. No, I know, it's all good. This is one of the reasons why I wanted this one, because I read that it was like super, super crazy durable. Doesn't and mean you should be durable. No, I know, but... <laughs> It's nice knowing that because I'm such a huge klutz that it's not. I'm a huge klutz. Yes. I'm a yeah. Look at Lamb of God. Yeah, that's. I just find that so funny. Why? Because Lamb of God is a band. That's not at all about God. <laughs> yeah, that except way. I'm pretty sure the term Lamb of God was biblical before it was a band. Oh no, I don't think so. <laughs> We're headed to the base right now. Um, Blake needs to get some shoes for his blues, so we're gonna pick up some new shoes for him. Blue and shoes. blue shoes. One of the first things we did when we got Noel was she got into a box that had his shoes in it and she chewed like the tip of them off. So she hasn't touched shoes since then. She doesn't care now, but. She, she'll pick up my shoes. Well, she'll, she'll pick up my running shoes too, but she doesn't eat them. She no, just she plays with them. Yeah. Like she's a knucklehead. She'll, she'll pick them up and she'll like throw them around. So we're gonna pick up some new shoes for him and I'm hoping to get like a sundress or something because the dress I'm wearing right now is the only short summery dress I have but it makes me feel kind of frumpy and gross and I don't know, it's just not super cute. So I wanna get like some nice, like a dress or something. So we're gonna stop at the BX and we're gonna look there and that's pretty much it I think. I kinda wanna like stay out and like do something but I'll have to think about things to do. What do you think? Food. Oh yeah, yeah, we're hungry. Oh, that's what we could do today. We could drive around and look at like places to that we want to live because our lease is almost up and we should probably start thinking about renting a new place. So, we could do that. Shiny shoes right there. We're trying to figure out what size Oil he is. Oh, sure. good. So I can wear them on the flight line. Oh, great. Which would never happen ever. <laughs> can you? This one's wider. Yeah. I'm not sure if I need the wider one, actually. You could try. I mean, whatever's more comfortable, right? Actually, this one doesn't... doesn't Why don't you walk around in them a little bit? Yeah. That looks so funny. You look so funny right now. With, like, your or your five-finger death punch shirt and... God. Yeah, this will be good. Mm-hmm. There you go. actually a lot more comfortable than my other ones. Really? It's a good thing she chewed them up. Yeah. <laughs> Little bit of an upgrade, huh? Yeah, everyone's like, when we first like got them and wore them, like back here, everyone had to put like band aids or moleskin. Blisters. No, well, blisters, but everyone's like healed with bleeding. Yeah, from like blisters yeah, and shit. Yeah. yeah. Welcome to the world of womanhood. Like every new pair of shoes is like that, especially heels and stuff. Yeah, well. Nightmare. Oh my God. What? Oh, the feeling of the new... Oh. oh my gosh, it does feel way yeah, better. Yeah, it doesn't feel like a trash bag. I want a pair of these so bad. Why don't you get, a pair? get a pair? Yeah, I mean, if they're that much more comfortable. Oh, they're light, too. Yeah. Do you need a new hat? <laughs> yeah. I mean, since we're I in here. Do. <laughs> yeah. Oh gosh, what size are you? You have a Please. small head. Uh, I think mine is a... Mine was a... That looks so clean. Oh my god. What? That's huge. Is it? This one's like the smallest here. Six and five eighths? Yeah. Try that. 
And then there's this one, which is the next size up. So I can't wear this one. Why not? Because it's, it's not lightweight. Oh. They all look the same to me. Oh. Yeah. At first it looked all the same to you. Like, uh... Wait, okay. So then you need that kind? Yeah, I have to have the lightweight one. I mean, technically, no one's going to say anything, but I want it. You're right. Magic. So, not this kind. Yes, that kind. Six and seven, eight. You see the squares? Did you try this one? No, not yet. Too big? Really? Yeah. It's, there's oh, tons of room. Dang. Yeah, I know. Gosh, you have such a small head. I know, I do. <laughs> one of these has got to be a seven and a quarter. Seven three eighths. What's that one? Looks like seven, seven and an eighth. But seven and an eighth didn't work. What's that one? Seven and an eighth. Oh. That looks good. That's actually almost too tight. So it's four thirty. Oh. I thought this happened at five. Four thirty, yeah. It stopped. It's so funny because like there's like two speakers, so right. like they keep... they're out of sync yeah. a little bit. Yeah. I didn't know it happened on the weekends. I didn't either. I don't think it, I don't think it did weekends at, uh, Shepherd. I don't know about Creech, because I'm never there on the weekend. I thought it happened at 5. Didn't it happen at 5 uh, at five Shepherd? 5 at Shepherd, yeah, here at 4.30. Never on base. Especially around this time. I know. Yeah, usually around this time, I would. Fly one. Hmm. Work does not stop on the flat line for music. Okay, now you can drive. So what happens? What? This person does. What happens? What? What happens if you're um? I don't know what I was gonna say. Is it something with Revelry? Yeah, it had something to do with Revelry, but. Rebel. Or not at uh, the retreat. Is. Yeah, whatever. It's revelry in the morning, right? Yeah. Does that happen yeah. in the morning here? Oh, it does here, yeah. I'd imagine you would just start sleeping through it. Yeah, right? but then you have all the jets and stuff taken out of there. Yeah. So I'm glad I don't have to worry about that. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I hear it a lot at our house, at the apartment, just because... Yeah, but you don't live next to the flight line where, like, actual jets are taken That's out. That's true. That is true. Oh, where'd they go? Got back there. Kind of touch and goes or something. We're chilling in the shade. Huh? Oh, it's too bright for this. Um, we're chilling in the shade. We're eating our food right now, and all these planes are just taking on and off. And Man, I don't know why there's planes here. It's like we're on an Air Force base or something. Yeah. I don't know. Where is it? I don't see it. I hear a plane. I hear one. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Right here? This plane? That's a big plane. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's okay. That's a, um... KC-1. KC-1. KC-1-5? I don't know the difference between them. They're both fuel, fuel tankers. That is a big plane. Kinda. Kinda. It's basically a seven... I think it's like a, like a triple seven. It's just... Outfitted for military. Oh. We're driving by the flight line right now because, I don't know, there were some pretty cool jets flying around and it's nice to be able to see them. Oh, you can see them right there. Yeah. They're just chilling, he's turning. That's so cool. Mm -hmm. Real jet. Is there like a place where we can like watch That's them? The Is there like an area? I think it's that way. Um. I'm not sure. Hey, he's turning. Is he landing? Yeah. <gasps> I want to see him land! Look, he turned again. Look at that. Wow, that's a really steep turn. Look at that. 
What is he doing? Oh, he's coming back around. Landing gear went up. Huh. Check it out. So those are B1s? Yeah, out there. That's cool. And then... B1 B Lancers. Wow, and then there's that plane. Mm-hmm. This is cool, though. Yeah. So open. Yeah. So we are literally driving around right now, just looking at houses. We're like popping, popping into all these neighborhoods and checking out the houses that are there and just the condition of the neighborhood itself. And I just feel like such a grown up right now. We're hoping to rent a house once our apartment is out. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, those look really nice. How do you look at a park or how do you look at houses in a gated community? Like, how do you do that? You have to be special. So in Las Vegas, most of the house, not no, most, but a ton of the houses are in gated communities like this. And it makes me wonder, how do you even look at the houses or like- Online. Yeah, but oh, that's like so lame. I want to get an idea for what it's actually like, you well, know? Well, you can probably- Contact the right people yeah. and get like a walkthrough yeah. and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah, you're probably right. Oh, do you want to um, take a left here? And then there's like houses here and stuff. So, anyway, we're looking at houses right now, hoping to rent a house once our lease is up in just a few months, so that way we have more space and a yard for the puppy dog and just all around nicer things. Hey, you could turn in here. Oh wait, is it gated? It's gated, JK. Hey guys, I wanted to just vlog this special moment because we're doing our very first live chat right now, which is pretty awesome if I do say so myself. I'm here with Blake. And we're just sitting here and literally chatting. Also, I had to pull it up in Firefox because the chat wasn't working. So that's what's going on right now. So all these people, what's up? Thank you for joining us. This is so wonderful. All six of them. Hey! Six watching. Yeah, yeah. I think that's a special Five achievement. Likes, that's good. Yeah, that's an achievement right there. So. I'm quite happy with this, and I think I want to do this more often. So, if you want to do more live chats, you should thumbs this up because <laughs> we're gonna totally keep doing this. I think. Oh. Danny, Caleb, and I were gonna try and play that song. And we had our little band. And it didn't work out. Who was the singer? Danny. Was he good? You know what? Most people who are in bands or sing or like our singers, most of them are very mediocre. You have to, it's just like any other job or profession. Well, yeah, but I mean, where did I, what is the quote? I don't remember what the quote is, but it's, it's like nine tenths perseverance and determination and like one tenth talent. You know what I mean? Obviously people that are good at singing are, I mean, they have that going for them, but you have to have a certain personality to make that work for you, you know? Taylor Swift, um, in my opinion, she's a very mediocre singer. She's like a good she, songwriter. She's a very good songwriter. She's beautiful. She's a beautiful human being. And I don't know how she is live, but I, I'm assuming she has decent stage presence. But her voice, like the voice itself to me is very vanilla. Jimi Hendrix is another good example. Very, very amazing guitarist, mediocre guitarist. singer. See, for me, though, I don't listen to music for, like, the lyrics, usually. It depends on what it is. I usually listen to it for, for the, the sounds. It sounds. Yeah, I know. That's why you listen to a very specific type of music. Like, you listen yeah. to Metallica yeah. and Five because Finger Death Punch. The, and The sounds. Not the, I mean, Five Finger Death Punch is also about the lyrics, too, because they have good lyrics. I like their lyrics. Yeah. But... It's mostly about the sound. Yeah. I'm kind of the same way, Um, except I like a different sound than you. I, I can listen to Metallica. I like Metallica, but like I like Bony Bear, and I like kind of more mellowy. So did my Ti. Yeah, I know. That's funny. That was so weird. I don't even know where I, where this conversation came from. I don't know. My point that I was trying to make. We were listening to a song, and the song got stuck. I'm trying to like. I'm trying to get out of the car. Hold on. The point is, we just got off an amazing live chat. Thank you so much for everybody who joined. And in the live chat, we were like, Blake. Blake was like, I need Cold Stone. So we're at Cold Stone right now. What are you gonna get? What are you gonna get? Hey, hey, hey. What are you gonna get? What are you getting at? You don't know? Okay. I guess we're gonna find out. Ooh. Ooh hey. Oh, that was a close one. Blake got. I got some Founders Favorite or whatever. Founders Favorite. It's like sweet cream ice cream with fudge. Brownie and caramel and usually pecans, pecans but yeah. I yeah, he was like, nah, I don't want pecans. So, and I got cookie, don't you want some? Which is vanilla, 
with cookie dough and chocolate chips and um, fudge and caramel, I think. I ate like half of it and now I'm full, so I put it in the freezer. <laughs> okay guys, so I am sitting down, I'm editing the vlog right now, and kind of like the same situation we had last weekend as this weekend, I got a decent chunk of footage this past weekend, so I'm gonna end it here and you'll see our Easter and what we did today in the next vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already, because we put out videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday at five o'clock Pacific time. So we'll see you next time. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Bye.